Hey y'all, welcome back to another cooking video. We're gonna make the Popeye's chicken sandwich. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is trim some of these fatty pieces off and then I'm gonna cut them in half. This one I may leave as is because it's pretty thin and small. beat the chicken up with this meat tenderizer and, and this is just a ziploc bag so now I'm gonna transfer all of the meat until uh, crap I should have I'm gonna put the buttermilk and the spices in here and let this marinate in the buttermilk and spices for about an hour if you got more time or if you can do this the night before of course it's best if you marinate it overnight I'm gonna just pour some buttermilk in here I'm gonna just pour enough in here to kind of coat it and the spices I'm gonna add is some garlic powder, some smoked paprika, salt, and pepper. While we waiting on the chicken to marinate, I'm gonna make some spicy mayo. So you're just gonna need some mayo, some hot sauce, you can use whatever kind you like, but I love Louisiana, paprika, and the garlic powder. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Alrighty then. <laughs> so I'ma just squeeze some mayo in here. I'm not gonna make that much. Hot sauce, garlic powder. If you don't want a spicy chicken sandwich, I guess have to make the mayo. Let me just stir this up. Boom, you basically dump this. Okay, this is not looking red enough for me. Yeah, this is not looking red enough for me. So, I'm gonna add a little bit more paprika. I'm gonna set this in the refrigerator until it's time to use it. For the flour batter, I'm just gonna throw some flour in here. And I'm basically gonna use the same seasonings that I've been using. I'm gonna throw in some cornstarch. I'm gonna drizzle a couple tablespoons of the buttermilk batter. Don't ask me why, I just seen people doing it. So I'm guessing the reason you add the buttermilk batter to the flour is so I can get like these little balls. And I guess that's gonna add crispiness. Crispiness and flakiness. So anytime I fry, I use peanut oil and that's what I have here. All right, let's drop it in there a bit. I'm not gonna crowd it. I'm just, uh, may do three, three at a time. All right, so I'm gonna melt some butter on this here skillet. These are the buns I'm using. So I'm about to slap these babies on here so I can get these buns nice and buttery. Got my butter kind of ain't burnt. That's <laughs> no, it's not. Okay, <laughs> this is the burnt. chicken. Oh, you don't got it. This is my chicken. She didn't want hers dipped in buttermilk. I set hers to the side and cooked hers it's separately. Exactly the same. So, grab a piece of chicken. I'm gonna I'm just grab a little it. piece. Try oh, it. the mayo sauce. Oh, yeah, if you like that mayo, yeah, it's just like that sweet sauce. Oh, she said it tastes like that piece. Okay. Okay, so I'm gonna just put, I already know I'm gonna like it, so I don't need to taste it. I'm gonna just slather a little bit on the, open them pickles. Before I'm about to pop a few 
Uh, Wait, the fries? Yeah, the fries is almost done. But that's not what this video is about, so we not, that's not the star of the show right now. I should have put the pickles over here. Deja put cheese on her sandwich. That's not a true Popeye's chicken sandwich. This is more like a Chick-fil-A deluxe, spicy deluxe. Wait, do we have a tomato? See? <laughs> I don't know. Wait, can, I, can you give me the um... pickles? No, she already took a bite. You like it? Mm -hmm. Wait. Mm -hmm. All she got was crunch. All she got was crunch. At least it's crunchy. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And it don't taste like Popeyes, like the batter and stuff, but yeah. it's still good. With, uh, with Popeye stuff, right? Okay. Chicken sandwich. <laughs> it's good. Ones, I mean, I don't even. I got mostly cheese. Like. Just taste it to see if it's good. I'm pretty sure. Tastes she like don't even want to bite bun. her sandwich. Tell me, she waiting on the fries. You can just take a little bite. Hmm. Tastes mm. like Chick Fil A without the spices. I mean, my chicken. I mean, mine's not the same as y'all. So it's just like. Yeah. That Hers wasn't marinated. Let's say like. Chick-fil-A. It do taste like chick the buns taste like Chick-fil-A. Yeah, the buns definitely taste like Chick-fil-A. Yeah. Yeah. You gotta get these brioche buns and you gotta put some butter on it. Hers don't even have butter on it. Awesome. Alright y'all. <laughs> there you have it. Like I said, this don't taste like Popeyes to me. Popeyes was much better. Thanks for watching. Bye.